You guys know what the fastest growing crime in America is? It is identity theft. And there's a new victim every 14 seconds. One of my brothers just recently experienced this. It was horrible, guys. He spent hours on the phone with companies trying to get everything situated. And to prove to, him, to prove to them that it was him, he had to send text messages to family and friends to let them know not to send this hacker money because it wasn't him. It was crazy. And that's why I'm excited to partner with today's sponsor, Aura. Aura is identity theft protection, fraud monitoring, VPN, password management, and antivirus software all combined into one easy use app. You might have one of these services already, but if you don't have all the tools, it's like locking the front door but leaving the back door open. Where are they doing that at? Those of you who have already had your identity stolen already are often shocked when this happens. Imagine trying to log into your email account only to realize that the password had been changed hours ago. And then later, you're getting notifications from your bank accounts, credit cards, and crypto accounts apps. Can you believe it? What are you gonna do? Who mm. I will be horrified. Thankfully, Aura monitors the dark web for your emails, social security number, credit cards, and they do it quick by sending alerts really fast right to your phone and email. Thank you for that. Aura also gives you near real-time alerts on suspicious credit card activities as if let's say like someone who was um, opening a loan or credit card in your name or VPN allows you to stay anonymous online while keeping your browser history and personal information safe and encrypted protect your family and yourself from identity theft by going to HTTPS colon forward slash forward slash aura dot com forward slash SIBO and snapper if you sign up right now or will give you a two week free trial with my link to see how many times you'll see your personal information or your family's personal information on the dark web. And if you sign up, let me know in the comments below if your personal information has been compromised. You won't regret checking. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> yeah. Man, we are back with another man. See, on snapper back at you like a, a strong back. Um, bring you another <laughs> trill. Yeah. Bring you another one of these trill ones, man. Before we get started, baby, go ahead and bring them on bring in. Bring them on in. What's going on, guys? How y'all feeling? Hope you're having a great day. Let's dive right into this video. So, man, I saw this on the comment section, man. And, um, you know, I do want to give a shout out to. Cause I just saw this, literally just saw this, and I was like, "Oh, that now that's a great thing to check out, man!" Shout out to um, Vania Men Menasi Menisi Menisi. Um, I think that's how you pronounce your name, brother. Thank I, you so uh, much for the recommendation. Thank you for the recommendation. You you Get said react to T9 Family Family Feud, but I'm just gonna react to a, a Family Feud to see what we think about them. Hopefully, we just didn't get copyright this first time doing this, but it looked so exciting. I said, I think I want us to do it. Let's do it. Let go. So it's where in the in the belly are you from? Steve meant in the belly tribe. Is that in the belly tribe? Yeah, the in the belly tribe. Yeah. I didn't even know Steve Harbor was in doing Family Feud in South Africa. Did you know that? No, I didn't. Let's go, Steve. Wit, wit. Give me Lucius, give me Raisa. The haircut fresh. I got to have that, man. You can have it, Steve. So tell me, what is this? Tell That's me. What. It. Wow. These are beads. But. I know they beads, man. <laughs> I'm not finished. I'm not finished. <laughs> Oh, it's still going on. I'm gonna finish. <laughs> you pause. You pause. He and did make a little look. long pause. <laughs> now listen to me. I'm over here trying to learn this culture. Yeah. Quit talking to me like I'm stupid. <laughs> <laughs> like, I know them is damn beats. <laughs> I asked you what was this? What this? It's a, there's a Ndebele word, uh, Nkholwane. And it is from what culture? Ndebele culture. 
in the in what? The in the belly culture. In the belly. In the belly. In the belly culture. Oh, this is in gonna be belly. too funny. Steve trying to understand country is Steve Let's trying to go. This is called a Kolwani. Kolwani. Yep. Cool. Let's go, Steve. Now the name of the uh people again? In the belly. In the belly. In the belly, yes. In the belly. Yeah. I can take you there. Yeah, yeah, where is it? Kondebele. It's in Pumala. Like, you'll be fine. Oh boy, that look. You just, you just playing with me right now. <laughs> what people are? It's the in in the belly. Okay, where is it at? In Kwadu belly. Yeah. <laughs> it's okay. It's about the the hour drive to Mwalanga. Two hours. No? It's about drive. an hour drive. One hour drive. Really? Yeah. You speed. No, no speed. How speeding. Far is it? What what the uh, hell is going on? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Got on the dress. <laughs> <laughs> he is from the Indigo Valley people, and me and him is going there. And we ain't driving either. And we're not taking you. Yeah. <laughs> Top six answers on the board. Name something that could end a friendship. Stole my boyfriend. Stole oh, that's my what I was boyfriend. gonna say. You stole my boyfriend. Lies. What? Lucas. Lies. You talk behind my back? Talk behind my back. Backstabber. 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 Gossip. Gossip. Backstabber. No, my timber. Oh, yes. I love that beard. Yes. Look at that. That's she looks so fire. pretty. She is, yeah. Timber. Yes. No, my timber. <laughs> What do you do for a living? Um, I just actually graduated. I'm now an intern doctor. Oh. You better go, sister. Look at, look at the steam <laughs> face. Very smart. <laughs> All right, introduce us to your family. OK, so these are my siblings. Um, we come from a big family of 12. Whoa. So this is just five of the 12. Um, this is Nontogozo. She non -togozo. is number. Nine, and then this is Lucas, uh, my brother. He is number two, and then that's Nompumelelo, my sister. She is number three. Mm -hmm. Nompumelelo. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna have to go to the bathroom. Stop <laughs> it! Say that name. I'm... <laughs> and who is the last one? The last one is Uneli Siwe, and she is. <laughs> 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 I love it. You know, we swear. I love it. <laughs> I'm gonna do the best I can. Welcome to the show. Okay, Thank you so much, Steve. Now this is entertainment. Yeah, this is good. Steve cut yourself, can't pronounce some names. He, he tried, oh, no, he look, tried. Look. He tried. We're gonna be wanting to answer the questions too. <laughs> Come on. Let's okay. go. Ready? Watch this right here. Hey Minky. Hey. <laughs> I remember the nickname though. Yeah. Good, good. What do you do? I'm studying agriculture, and I'm doing my practicals next year. Really? Oh, how old are you? I'm 22. 22? Yes. Wow. Oh, my goodness. My <laughs> 22-year-old son is here. Uh -oh. <laughs> <laughs> what? He like, Look. he like, he like smart, <laughs> he pretty. Come on, boy. Okay, hey, hello, come on, come on. Come on. Come on, come on, boy. <laughs> he is for real while you playing. <laughs> like, where you at? Oh, I gotta see if what Lucas say though. Yeah. <laughs> Lucas controls that, yeah. so we have to see if <laughs> Lucas lets him. If Lucas can let him ask for permission to talk to you. Do you know Lobola? <laughs> Do I have Ebola? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, I 
feel like I got my mama's shirt. <laughs> Ooh, oh, oh man, that's too much, bro. That's too much. Stop that's it. too much. <laughs> that's somebody that would love this. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Do you I know, don't want Ebola. Do you know Lobola? Do I know where your bowl is at? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know you had a bowl. <laughs> what is Lobola? Um, since you want your son, or oh, you think your son can marry my sister. No, I didn't say marry. <laughs> uh, okay. I don't know. She's very pretty. Okay. But what is Lobola? It's like a down payment or something. A down, down payment. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> oh my, uh, what's that thing? Oh my God. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Not a down payment. Um, what the hell is going on? <laughs> well, how much is the down payment? It depends on how, what my fa how much my father wants. It's cattle and money. Cattle? Yes. <laughs> I don't have no cattle, dog. Yo. But I got money. Y'all want a car or something? I get you a car. <laughs> How about two Range Rovers? Okay. Okay. We got no cattle, dog. I, I can get you a Mercedes and a couple of Range Rovers. Now we talking. Okay. okay. A bit. He would more than that. More and then some money too. And some money too. Like how much money? Just give me an example of what you. Bro, he done already forked off 300000 Or more. <laughs> Depends on the year and the model. True. But I'm saying, look, the Benz, let's say you get a nice high end, 100. Mm -hmm. okay. Range, or yeah. like 80, mm -hmm. 90, 90. 300000 yeah. okay. right now. Father might ask for just make it up something. She's educated. Educated. She's educated She's and pretty beautiful. and yes. beautiful. Very alive. And she comes from a very good family. And very good. I love the family. Um, very good. A hundred thousand rand. A hundred thousand rand is eight thousand US. Ah ah ah! Steve, let's go. So actually, Steve, by you saying out the car, you gave up because that means so if eight thousand rand, you didn't gave up what? Um, how many millions in Rand? You didn't gave up uh, like 300 million Rand? I don't know how many million, three million Rand, four million Rand? Like you, you went in, you put that number out there, G. You gotta make the chief. <laughs>